Hi guys, welcome back to another video, and today we are going to be starting my Minecraft modded series on dreams and nightmares. Now, I'm sorry if my uh, mic is very loud, I currently have two PCs right next to me running, so, gotta deal with that. Now, I have been playing dreams and nightmares for a long time, although I did recently delete all my worlds except from this one, which I just recently started, as you can see. By the date. So we're going to be creating a new world, it's going to be survival, which is the basics, and I don't know what to call this, I'm just going to call it YouTube world, because why not, create new world. Well, all that loads, I'm going to go get a drink, but I'm going to mute my mic, so we'll be back in a second. Okay guys, so, um, this mod pack, when I first load it, is always a bit laggy. This first episode is going to be a bit slow, but, um, as you can see, it's starting to get a little bit better. Let me just check my video settings. Unlimited frame rate, 10 chunks. Yeah, everything's on how it should be. So I've given time to load. Let's, uh, start my inventory. There isn't really that good. People are you. You there. You there. You there. You there. Open up as a backpack. Give me all that in there. Give me something good. <gasps> Dragon chest plate. Aha! That is an amazing first piece of art. Hello, traveling villager. Huh? Nothing good. I'm going to kill you. Oh, loot bag. Yes, some claws. And my first set of weapons. And that's a B. I don't think really he's keeping in this game. It can be worth it sometimes, but it's just not my style. Yeah, oh. That's a very deep underwater wreckage, and I know how I'm going to do Oh, and there's one over there, okay. I need to get some wood. Get some normal wood. And that is a... Um, what do you want to call it? Completely blank now. Meteor, that's a meteor. Meteor crash site. Unfortunately, I can't do anything with that until I get a diamond level pickaxe. I don't know how much I'm going to need, so I'll get one more. I don't 
probably want to use the claws unless I have to. Let's make some doors. Probably wondering why am I making doors? Unless there's a um, updated data pack in this, which I don't think I've added an updated data pack because I have added so much for mods as the morph mod and also tombstones. But I haven't added anything more than that. Um, well, other than the um, resource library for the morph mod. But before I go down there and then drown to death, I'm just going to place a door here and test it. Yeah, as you can see, when the door's there, I can now breathe. So I'm going to pick this, make sure I grab it because I need it. I need at least three. Let's go to the surface. I could really do no. I need a night vision potion for that. So I cannot see once I'm down there. Look at that, that just goes pitch black. So I like this texture, this uh, mod pack. But I completely, I completely forgot about the deep sea update on here, which basically just makes it so if you go too far underwater, it goes dark. So until I can get like uh, sea lanterns or anything like that, I basically can't do anything with that shipwreck. I really wanted to. Um, I hate those brain slimes, they're the worst. <gasps> Diamond knife and some torches. Okay, I've got torches up there. Um, I'm not. Oh, oh. I'll keep with the door just in case there's some, um, just a little higher up in the water. Should probably keep a look over here just in case I can see a village or something. Is that a frog? Is it a lizard? What is it? Frog! Give me your form. It was painful. But I have to. That is another type of frog. Come here, boy. I don't know if you can get this will actually count as a new form or not. Apparently it doesn't. Scares myself. Until I get saturation or anything like that, um, I don't really like changing. Because if you go to a form that has lower health and then change back, your health does not go back to what it was. It stays as what it is. So you lose health by morphing. I could use this to farm um, loot bags, but um, the time it would take, because one I have to wait until night time, which that isn't a problem, wait until night time is fine, it just takes forever um, for them to actually start spawning unless you leave the area. And then come back, but then I've got to travel at night time, which is dangerous as hell. Okay, I'll leave a spawner for now. Try to place that there, because up there's a skeleton spawner, which is the worst. So I'll now break this one. Tons of XP. Me realising I just blocked off my only exit. They're out the skeleton one. Now in here, skeletons will spawn. Because it's dark. Just gotta break this pretty quick. Rimsky. Now that I've done that, I can also... I should just break this one at the start, but completely was not thinking about it. Okay. Tons of XP. Well, it looks like I'm stuck on a very, very tiny island, as I can see it on journey map. Looks like I'm 
to land or have a look. Ooh, that's not what I want on. J, yep, close, boom. That is the island I'm stuck on, that blue one is me. So, looking at it, I'm going to have to craft a boat and um, do some adventuring. All of you are terrible. Give me a loot bag, please. And the loot bag. Any more? Oh, there's tons. I want all of their loot bags. Don't think you can get away from me. Oh, I hate the weird hitboxes of them. But it's fine, it's fine. I'm basically going to wipe out every single life form on this island. For anything I can get my hands on. Armor. Uh, basically as many loot bags as I possibly can. Hope I get some armor in it. Even if it's not even enchanted armor, just armor would be nice. Since I've only got that chest plate. And the chest plate, the dragon armor, is very, very strong. But it's only a basic at the moment, which is sad. And the only way to increase is uh, to get experience. And the only way to get experience on armor is to take damage. Um, so yeah, that's, that's going to be a pain. Cause yeah, look, you see the minor amount of durability. This one durability that's been taken off. I have two XP for it. But it doesn't have mending on it, so I can't just go and take damage on purpose because I end up destroying the chest plate. And I could use um, resources to um, inc uh, increase the durability, basically repair it. Um, that is a lot of work. And a lot of um, resources. For a stone pickaxe, it took four pieces of stone to do. Save me two sticks. I had like five, six stacks of sticks at that point. So building something new saves you um, resources. But then also the dragon chest plate is a. I don't think the dragon chest plate is actually craftable. Oh, that's annoying. Can I sleep yet? I can't, okay. I need to move. Oh, windows. I want to move the capture status somewhere else. You know, I haven't done it. Because that's blocking the. Um... Okay, once that gets to 1020, which is now. Maybe they updated it. It used to be 1020 and you could sleep. Ah, uh, 10.30, so they've added, um, you have to wait 10 seconds extra for it. You know what, that is fine by me. It just means I get more time in the day before I have to sleep. So if I wait any longer than 10.30, mobs start to spawn because the sun is fully down at that point. That is what I liked about when it was 10.20 to sleep. Um, the sun was still kind of up, just at the edge, um, which was really handy because at that point no mobs were spawning and you could just sleep straight through it, zero mobs. One more and I'll have two stacks, give me one piece. There we go, two stacks of wood. It's a good amount to start off with. That actually makes me question, where the hell are all these wandering traders coming from when we are on an island with no, without a village? Hamster, give me your form. Yes, a rare. No, that's an epic. Oh, it looks like a rare from the item drop. Golden sword, golden glaive. Iron pickaxe and a taser. I haven't got a squid form yet, but that helps. They 
Uh, you know, I might not even need to make a boat if I get small form. Or if I found a bat, actually. If I <gasps> oh my god! Sweeping Edge 3, Inside 3, Light Pierce 4, and Looting 3, and it's a diamond sword! And I got a diamond glaive, and an iron shovel, and a diamond hammer. What the absolute hell is my luck? That was uncommon. Game 4, give me it. I can't believe that. I basically just got like a full diamond set of weapons. From an uncommon bag. Well, if I get a... Um... God, I can't remember what they're actually called. <sighs> Regeneration! Gimme, gimme, gimme! Aha! Now I don't have to worry about damage as much. I could increase regeneration at some point. Pretty sure you can have multiple levels of regeneration. But yeah, because it goes common, uncommon, rare, epic, legendary, artifact. I can't remember what the next one is, I've just got another epic, and there's a bag here. Some gold horse armor. Bag. Zombie heart, redstone. Redstone, if I was further into the game, I would keep. But I'm not far enough in for it to act. Maybe worth anything. So I'm gonna head over to the um, crash site over here. Come on, come in. I hate fighting more. I realise the reason I'm doing hardly any damage is my sword is broken. So it's it's literally on one point of damage. Give me the kill. Got wool and some raw mutton, which isn't worth anything at my point. Brain slime, stay. You know, what? come at me. I got. I have a good amount of reach. such a close-up weapon. It's not broken yet, but it's doing hardly any damage. Doing more than the wooden sword. I need to get some food, though. Shipwreck, uh, that's the shipwreck I was at. Um, actually not. I'll have the dagger out. I wanna go kill one of these and get their form. Nice! Okay, now I have the squid form, so I don't have to worry about making a boat as such. Eat that and eat. Yes, like that. I really need to get food. I hate not being able to run. Not being able to sprint. Food, please. Golden battle axe, iron ingot, iron hammer, and lapis. I do them to get rid of that, and I'll use the gold battle axe. <laughs> nice, another epic loot bag. Um, MRE, yep, that is amazing, and hearts of gold. You guys can screw off. I will use the hearts of gold. And get rid of the bottles, so I don't need them. Come here. Thank you. I need all the XP I can get. 
Shank. 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 Give me more loot bags. Before I head off to the next island. Nothing. So I'm going that way. And that way. Um. That doesn't look like there's much there, it looks like there's a hill there. This way kind of looks like has been more. I might have to increase my render distance now that it's loaded. Oh yeah, there, that's reasonably sized, I can deal with this. I'm definitely going to increase my render distance to 12 again. Oh, yes. Mob spawner house. I normally have it at 12, but when I'm on here, any more than 10 is a bit lag. It's really bad when you first join. It's getting laggy now just doing this. Medium. Medium shape. Look how lag it is. Did I get that? Did I get the camera? Nope. I want your camera to die. Oh yeah, I did, it's in my inventory now, I still want more though. Three. Four. Five, let's go. Keep on rolling it. Six. And seven, let's go, that's a good amount of uh, camera die. I love the camera die. I realised I've been going to... Ow! Get off my head. Oh, you... Jump on my head. I hate those brain slimes. They're most annoying. Yeah, I have an MRE and use maximum health. Spider eye can screw off. I'm going to be running less, so that definitely drained it. I'm only going to have to run if I really have to at this point. So, they drop spider flies. Yes, it gives me food. It also poisons me. Where are you? Oh my god. Don't need you and don't need you. I did level up my bat luck, so. I would find the uh, iron, but you get iron fragments and you do a whole bunch of stuff like that that I cannot be bothered to do. Also, there is a fire. Which I'm guessing means that there is a lava pool. Yeah, there's a lava pool. A dirty plate. Rare loot bag that we get in for it. Yes, it's full. Another diamond hammer. I don't do um, this. Okay, let's get the loot from this. Hopefully, it's just a zombie one. Um, and normal, I break off these pots. The pot defense. And get these two tiles and break this thing. in there that's really important. Only 100. Killed me first zombie. 
Ooh, give me more fuck. Baby. One thing I hate is fun. You know what? Ruin it. Yeah, I'm not holding anything, because I know what you like. I can see that this is going to be a pain as he makes you drop your weapons. Oh, give me it back. Give me back my knife. Give me back my knife. I know I have tons of weapons, but... Chicken drop you. See, there's a lot I need to go over with this thing. Um, right, yeah, I need range to be able to open it. Some tin, that'll come in handy. Okay, let's open up my bag and just like dump all of that in there. Plus them. Keep my iron pick and keep. The golden sword, I can place them in there. And then, you know, I'll also keep the glaive to drop that in there. And I've got a set of weapons to work with. And open this one to baubles. And, um, what's that one? Kaboomski. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm gonna break that. It's up there. And I'm also going to place that there. Just come on. And um, bring out this trapdoor. And place that there. spawned. And as much as they can come up and hit me, I have power. Although I do not have sound. Now I, I got a zombie head. Maybe they won't attack me now. Oh, 
Generation. Pick loot bag I was missing. Some shards. I do want to grab them. Gems of pure darkness. I see a spider. I have to go get it. I need its form. I see two spiders. Oh, that's a spider. That's a spider spider jockey. Well, I don't know. Yeah, I guess it's, it's a spider jockey on a spider. Yeah, some, something in that line. This is spider spider jockey of sorts. Stop doing that. Oh my god. Oh, what? He can teleport. That's a special ability. He has teleportation. Oh, and he has pull. He has pull as well. Oh, there's two specials on one. That is so unfair. Luckily, regeneration on my side. And also water. I'll use the water to my advantage. I'm supposed though to use that. I guess it's like having a little bit of You flew me to the surface is only helping me. I'm getting air and then I'm falling back under. You're not the special, you're the special one I want to kill. But do you regen? Retribution. Oh my god. Oh! Hey, you! Are like nothing. I can kill you without a sweat. I just want the normal spider, so I have the normal spider. You just have a reach, that is what you have. So as long as I keep this, you basically don't get a chance to hit me. Very, very fast over here. I'll leave that for um, a little skeleton warrior. Let me just be in real quick. Yes, I know. 
Oh. Damn me. Oh god. Why is it so fast? And why is it running into... You know, I just realised I have a regeneration and could probably take him. So I'm going to try. Probably a bad idea. But, um... Oh my god, he takes no damage! Why does my sword no, do no damage to him? I don't know, all I know is there's a house over here. And I really want to know what's inside. Stuff. Where's the- the door is against the wall over here. There's a chest. Boom. Uh, nothing worth taking. I guess I can take these torches. Torches might be nice. Okay. Boom. Yeah, I was going to say, I swear I saw a torch out here. And I did. Neat. Snake in the grass. Are you gonna like charge attack me or something? Like normal snakes do. Jump at me. Ha. Huh. I don't know what that is, and to be honest. Oh, that's another snake. Why is there so many snakes? Why is there snakes everywhere? I don't know. All I know is there's a lit beetle loading and I want his form. Oh, screw up snakes. I don't think you can hide from me. Because you cannot. Yeah, you're coming for me now. You're coming for me now. That's what I thought. I'll destroy you all. Yeah, there's more beetles over here. I already have beetle form. And I don't think I get loot bags from beetles. Like wood. There's something down here. I don't know if it's this massive, like, um, this small tower looking thing or not. Oh no, it's this thing. Kind of looks like it, I guess. I hear an eagle. I want, uh, I want to kill a bird of sorts. I know that sounds cruel, but being able to fly is a massive advantage in this. I really need to get saturation. And I have to worry about eating again. Oh, a hen. The lag. I'm sorry. It hurts me very much to do that. I now have a pretty collective set of stuff. Snakes are kind of freaking out a bit. And I have a lot of um, brain slimes staying on myself. Hedgehog! I'm going to turn my render distance down, it's actually killing my game. Options, video settings, render distance. Better FPS options, prelocate. Memory on, fast. To check on, fog, fast. Fast, 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 beacon. Done. No. I put what I had to. Hopefully that 
increase my FPS a bit. Ravens? Oh, kill me a raven. Get me a raven. Die. All of you. Die. Have ravens, feathers, or bewitchment. Once again, it's another thing I don't really do, the bewitchment stuff. Oh, really cute. More ravens. Maybe you're an eagle. Whatever. I have another zombie head and it's stacked for some reason. I should have left that stacked to be honest. I'm gonna take my armor. Get rid of them. And where's the raven? Raven. Take the shield as well. Can you actually fly with the raven or does it not actually? It doesn't give you. See, so there's little abilities on here. So that one's got the water ability. That one's got burning at daylight. Um, unless you become the baby. That reinforced baby spider doesn't have anything. Those spiders don't have anything. Chicken has feather falling. Well, the hen has feather falling. Chicken has feather falling. I don't have anything that actually gives me the ability to fly, but you know what? Luckily, with the form I used, I got my uh, heart back. Some of the forms are a bit glitchy though. It's a wandering cover, and that's a house. Oh no, that's a village. Okay, journey map. Tank, you have led me to where I wish to go. Comedians. Broken sword. Eatus deletus. Chameleon. I want to find a rat. I really want to find a rat and kill it. I also want to find one to keep. It's really tempting to just kill every single thing I've got. Look what I mean. There's a bed. I'll take torches. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go around. I'm just going to grab all the torches. One I'm going to keep. And one that can be. Oh, you're a different type of chameleon. I wish to kill you, but the wandering trader is getting in the way. I got my way. Yes, you gave me an epic loot bag. Oh, with basically nothing in it. I'll start having nothing in it, because it's bad. Give me a piston. I keep hold of pistons. Torch. Leather tunic. I keep hold of that. I can come in quite handy. A bed up here. I'll use to sleep. I am very, very low on uh, hunger. Do some shit then. Give me all the potatoes. If it's one of those big houses, which there is in the background, I might make this uh, where I live. After all of that, I've got two potatoes out of it. Okay, well, whatever I get out of this, I'm keeping. Not. As much as I want to keep it, it goes to that point where um, I just take everything, but I'm not going to have anything in the future. This thing needs to go. Three 
regeneration. to worry about. That one's a pet store. I can get all my rat stuff from there. Let's um, check this one. Anything good in here? No. Just a regular village house. This is a bee house, so normally... Unlit candles? I'll take them. I don't mind grabbing unlit candles. Generation. Boom. Oh, how dare you? That is rude. I would kill you if I didn't get all the other village mad. That is a dungeon house. Oh my god, that's a dungeon house as well. This has got to be like the most luckiest village spawn ever. Okay, let's get the statistics booklet to find out what's in the dungeon of this house. Down there. Which I'm not going to enter. Oh yeah, I can read this now. Now that I've done that, I can... Eat that away. Protection one, and I'm breaking one. That's got mending, that's statistics. That's a shovel, luma, apples. Yeah, that's about all I need. Okay, awesome, Le heat on the leggings. Glowstone extract. So, how many chests? There's 72 chests in there, and 107 mob spawners. 32 TNT. That's insane. So I, I can get 74 chests out of this thing. I wish I had like an item frame or something. That should give me that. I went way past that, but you know what? That's fine, I'm just gonna go into this corner and do it again. Now I can't get them. And they can be spawn in peace. Yeah, can I like just like place it in the furnace? I can as well. Okay, so it's in the furnace if I need it. I shouldn't because it just tells me what's in the house. That is not what I'm living in, but it is full of stuff that's important. Good stuff. I'm pretty sure there's chests in this tower. Pretty sure. Um, actually, that remembers me. I should probably cr craft one of them instead. Oh! I just teleported. You know what? I'm not even going to question that because I just got stacks of arrows. Oh my god. Literally stacks of arrows and axes and bows. One, I can put that away, and I can also put that into there. Nice. Well, like I said, I don't know how I teleported, somehow I teleported. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There it is! So you click on a ladder, it teleports you up and down the ladder. Okay, there's no one in there, but it's nice to clear their path for one. Important house. Give me that iron. Give me those, they're well important. Give me that. Of course, that. Yes, 100%. Let's... Let's get rid of... Oh, oh yeah, there's a new point. Leather cap. I can get rid of the... Them. Hang on there. 
Obsidian is very good to have, and I can get rid of them. Nice, there's nothing in those furnaces. They're just there for show. Speed pickup. Have me all of them. I second thought I picked up the dirt, I was so confused. Do you know what must happen? Oh, I'm sorry. It hurts me inside. Play Doctor. Cool, I'm gonna go steal from you. Play Doctor House now. I'm gonna to search the rest of these. Nerting. Nothing important. Like look the house. I still haven't got the pet store one yet. I really need to. Okay. Hello. Yes. Okay. Wait. I was there. Pick up. Pick up the cheese block, which is good. Plague house there, which I need to do. Plague doctor house. I once again need to get cheese. The more cheese the better, anything good. Purifying liquid cures mobs with plague. Um, and has a 25% chance to remove the plague effect. Take the apple. Um, I can remove that, and as much as I want to remove one of the bows, I'll remove an axe instead. Because bows are hard to come across. I'm not going to take the traps, because I want to catch one, not kill it. But the traps will kill it. Search every house. Oh my god. Everybody move out the way. All the girls out the way. Lots of iron golems. This is the house I'm going to be staying in. Just search the rest of these. I could have a bare hand to be able to do it. Yeah. I didn't think they had added anything to the, any of the houses. Okay, let's. I realised I should probably go quickly dump off stuff in my house because I literally have no space left. Let's do this. Lots of wheat. I can make tons of bread. Let's go to my room. Incorrect room. Correct room. Not the cap. Tools. Levitation, I don't know when I got that, but I have it. Yeah, Luma. That way. Yeah, arrows. Wait, I don't love it. Tuna can get rid of. This chest can be full of important stuff like that. And then also important blocks. Down the cheese, hopefully they'll come for it. Yeah, I can turn you into a special crafting table. I also can move you out of the room because that room does not need a crafting table. Some sleep and continue taking everything from the village.
<sighs> oh my god, I'm tired myself and I'm in real life. I don't want flour because I want to start making wheat as soon as possible. Keep the leather tunic so I can make sets of armor. Take that wheat and then all of the arrows into there. Design this. There is a lot of ways. If I place that and I just click exit, that does make a board across it. It kind of looks cool. Okay, I can see how this is going to be annoying. Where those golems, they look like bullies or picking on the one play doctor. <laughs> but, um, so, looking on from the side, doesn't look too bad. Just got to remove these blocks. Well, if it drops onto the balcony, I'm going to get it afterwards, because I can guarantee it will. somewhere I'd be tempted because I want to do what I did there on that side as well um, I don't have a spare fence currently so now that I've done that I can do what I wanted to do and that is replace the floors um, but as I do this I'm going to be signed off because 
been a full hour of recording. It's been a good start to the episode, um, to the series, actually. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have to... But, um, as I do the hardest way of doing this, um, it's been a good start to the series. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. We're going to be continuing on with the series pretty soon. Um, next time we're going to break down this wall and increase it to a larger house. And probably another crafting table there. Do a bit on this floor. Do a bit on this floor. And also get an iron door so it's not coming into my house. Um, but yeah, other than that, I'm not really sure what to do. Continuing looting, because I think I've got, I just did that one. So I've got that one, that one, that one, that one. And the pet store over there. That I've got to do. And then I also need to finish off doing the floors for my balconies upstairs. Um, so I've done that one, so yeah, I need to do the floor of this one. So like I was saying, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I've definitely enjoyed it, and we'll definitely carry on. Um, if you enjoyed it and would like to support me, um, please drop a like, subscribe. And um, yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.